on the ballot tonight. Madison and Sun Prairie both voted on school referendums. NBC 15's Avery Hall is here with what we know about changes to funding in the coming years. John and Lee, we're still waiting on the results of both Madison's and Sun Prairie's school referendums. Now, here's what's at stake. Sun Prairie's referendum, if passed, would budget $89.5 million towards two new elementary schools. And the second part of the referendum would allocate about $2 million more for operations and hiring in those new schools. Madison's referendum would increase the district's operating budget by about $26 million each year. And that's something that board member Ed Hughes says would be a step forward. If it does pass, then we'll be able to um, use our own budgeting discretion and provide the kind of education that we think our community is, uh, wants and is willing to pay for. And as of right now, both referendums are favored to pass by about a two to one ratio, and keeping in mind that only about half of votes have been counted at this time. Madison Metropolitan School District predicts an average increase in tax bills of about $60 per household in the next year if the referendum passes.